guys. This is finally the 2023 season. This is the beginning of the baseball season, which is to start out with the winter season. The Diddy Monkeys, they won the latest season, which they're at. Is this the right profile? Which they're at six rings. And now they start off this season playing the Burrow Bows and a change up from this season to last season, which is. And change up from last season, which is that instead of there being six games, I think there's six games, now it's 12 games. And right now, the Diddy Monkeys to start out with their lineup. So no green toad and Toadette is back on the field, even though their backup Tiana made an impressive start of her season. So Alberto is in. Just to start off the season of the Bungle Bows and the Diddy Monkeys. Alright, and here they are. There's nine endings. And the Diddy Monkeys are to bat first. So they're on top and they're not on bottom. Right. In the first thing, Blue Toad hits a home run. And it's going out of there. Wow, that is not a good start for the Butter of O's. But as they can see, this is the Diddy Monkeys, but still, let's see what Peach does. Just a slider. Right. And Diddy Kong. So it's a bat with no powers. Blue Toad is already starting off this season in excellent, now in an excellent start. And Mario, last season for the fall of 2022, Mario's season was not that good. But let's see what type of turnaround that Mario can make. And as you can see, to start off, it's not that good. But, but this is just the first. And when you don't have powers, that's kind of like a pressure on you, even if you don't use powers. And Goomba is up to that. Right. Mario doing great in that backfield. Three outs. <laughs> Pinata. To bat. Two powers up. And look at that home run right there from Blue Pinata. The Diddy Monkeys is off to a great start. As Yellow Toad, another home run hitter, is up to bat. 
swing way too early. And, uh, that's not a good hit there from Yellow Toad. Very Goomba. I don't know what's gonna happen, but I think the coach is gonna face a little bit of backlash from putting Toadette over Tiana after Tiana played so well in the fall season. Hmm, and Paragoomba's out. And right as I speak of Toadette, now Toadette's up. She uses a power. Great hit. And Blue Toad is up, and they have two outs and two people on base. And that's still a good hit, as now he's also on base. And who's up? Peach, and she also has the only boy's powers. Mmm. But there is many girls that that's on the field. She does the power, but it does not work. She doesn't waste it. Mmm. She now has two powers. Peach uses her power! And it works! And Toda decides to stay. That's kind of a good move. And Diddy Kong is up with no powers as Peach has used them all. And it still works as Blue Nika jumps too early. And now they are up by five, and Blue Toad makes it home. Mario is up to that. Mario needs to turn his season around. Mm. Still doesn't do it there. But that was a great run for the Diddy Monkeys as they're already up 5-0. This is just the second ending. It's a home run. And then we'll get it. Two outs. He just misses it. Rupa decides to stay. And as the Nikos are just not playing a well game right now, as now it is a third ending and the Diddy Monkeys are to bad. I think the Diddy Monkeys, they're gonna try to go for that strategy like possibly scoring. Every ending. And as they hit a home run. And it's out there! Boom Pinata hits it literally out there. And as now they are up six to nothing. And what are the Birdo Bows gonna do? Because now they're switching their pitcher because the Birdo's not getting it done. And they switched it to Yoshi. Toad hits it out. Paragoomba uses a power and it doesn't quite work. And now Goomba's up with no powers. And that's going out. The burrow bows are up to back. And Yoshi doesn't make it. Oh, 
bom mais uma carreira. Alright, and that's three outs. And they still have zero points up as the Diddy Monkeys have six points and entering the fourth ending. And Toadad is up to bat. Let's see if they have any powers. And they don't. And Peach also has to bat as well. And Yoshi uses his power. Great hit from Toadette. As she stays on first base. Smart. And Blue Toad is up with no power, but I don't really think he needs any. Oh. It's a good strike there from Yoshi. And that's fair. Toadette's out. And Blue Toad is safe. And Peach is up with no powers, but she has hit a home run before, just like Goomba, but it's pretty rare. Mmm, that would have been a great hit, but she just swung too early. And yeah, that's gonna be out. And that's a double out, so now the Diddy Monkeys will not score in every ending. And as Birdo Bows is up to bat, Birdo, Pink Yoshi, and Paratroopa. Birdo with a nice hit, and Peach was just there to catch it as it is fair, and Birdo gets to first base. Pink Yoshi gets both of them out, that is not what they want. Now Mario will get them for the third out! And they still have zero points up on the board as now it is the fifth ending and Diddy Kong is up to bat. Let's see if they have any powers for Diddy Kong because he is a power spe now a specialty batter and they don't. So now he just has to rely on getting that basic out. And now Mario's up. Let's see if Mario will hit any home runs as he did for previous years, but not for that last season or this year as he's still hitting the same. And now Blue Pinata as he hit a major home run, he's up to bat again. And just a little slider and that's another three and out. As now it's time for the Birdo Bows to bat on bottom of the fifth. As they have people who have powers, but they're not using any of their powers surprisingly. Oh, and Mario misses that again. That is a great play that Mario decided to use. And Nika, as she hits a high ball, I guess, there, but it's still out, so it doesn't really make any effect. And as Pink Nika's up, It's a nice ball, but it just isn't enough. Like, they need to be going for the home runs, but Birdo and the Yoshis need to be using their powers. And this is why the Yoshi Eggs has always been, you know, like that dominant new team. They aren't afraid to use their powers. Alright, and as they're all safe on base, they have a chance to score with a, with a well enough play. What will Nika use it? That's just and then straight to Mario. And now it's the sixth ending. And Yellow Toad. And Yellow Toad is up to bat. Oh, that's a good strike right there. And Yellow Toad hits a home run! And will it go all the way out? And it does not, as Birdo and Pink Yoshi was fast enough to catch the out. Paragumba. <laughs> it's another out. And now Goomba with no power, so it's very crucial. It's fair. Any power, so it's kind of hard. 
she hits a great ball right down the side. No home run there, but that is a far ball. As they will score two off that play, Blue Toad is way on it. And now Peach with no powers. Mm. Doesn't make it. Now the Bartle Bow steal with zero points up on the board. Will they score? And Shy Guy. Looking to hit a home run. It's Peach and Blue Toad. Come to stop him. It's another out. Alright. It's really hard for them to stop those balls as they are not hitting really any five balls. Gertrude just makes it. Ooh, and now they have three people on base. And Nika again does not let them score as she hits it straight. To the fielders and Diddy Kong is up to bat. Let's see if he has any powers. He has one. Now be enough. Mm, I don't know if he used it too early though. And she's just right. Surprisingly, Pink Yoshi did not use the did not use the Yoshi tongues. Now Mario is up to bat. Will Mario make a change? Hmm. Hopefully the coach does not bench Mario, but looking at right now, Mario, he kind of deserves to be benched. The only reason why Mario still out there because Mario and Peach, they are compatible, and that's a great hit from Mario. But the reason why Mario still out there because Mario and Peach, they are, they are, compa they are compatible to do those power balls. And Blue Pinata, as he already hit a home run earlier, doesn't swing on, on Yoshi's power. It's a nice ball, but not yet. And that's the first strikeout of this game. And Yellow Toad is up. It's a not ball. It's not enough, and Diddy Kong decides to go down. And as they score from that play, now they're switching their pitcher. Green paratrooper. Alright, and they're out. This is the bottom of the seventh. They still have no points up. Will that be enough to make them score? As they're hitting it down to the second, she doesn't make it! What a great play from the Diddy Monkeys! Yeah, I think right now they're really just trying to spread it here. Yeah, those Nikos, they are not doing any good... any good hits or any good plays. For the now for the Birdo Bows and now it is the top of the eighth and the Diddy Monkeys is up to bad. Goomba with the one power. We don't do him enough. And it's fair. And as Goomba makes it all the way to the third. That's a really good play. Now Toadette's up. another fair and as they score 10 points up on the board no mercy rule and blue toad is up to bat zero outs
Toad that makes it, and so does Wu Toad. As now zero outs and they're still up 10-0. Mm -hmm. Peach. What is going on with the Birdo Pose? As now the Diddy Monkey score and it's 11 0. And Diddy comes up to bat, but he doesn't have any powers, but does it really matter looking at the small mistakes that the Birdo Pose is making? And that's a double out play. That's a good play. And now Mario is up to bat with two outs. And Mario hits an out. It's just not looking good for Mario this season. Or, well, this is just the first game, but that's what we also said last year. Now the Birdo Bows, they're up to bat. Not a good three and out round for the Butterbows. As now they're down to one more ending. Will they even score a point on the board? And now Blue Pinata is up to bat. <laughs> Yellow Toad is also up to bat as an instant out. Those fielders, they are not doing the Birdo Bows any good. Paragon goes out, or out to bat, with one power. Nice play right there from Green. Paratroopa needs to do that again. And it gets Paragoomba out. That's a nice play right there. But although Para, now Paragoomba is wasting those powers, they bring out one of the Nikos. That's an instant out. Now that's a good play right there. And now this is the final ending in for the Birdo Bows. Good for them. That's the game. Those Nikas was not making it any good for their team with the batting. But the Diddy, but the Diddy Monkeys win their first game, 11 to nothing. Great way to start off their season, as they are the defending champs. Now that is how you start off the season. So let's look at their stats. Start off the year, and Blue Toad is MVP, well deserved. He had some high stats too. So, what we do. So, we're just gonna look at how much they made. So, Blue Toe, 130. Peach, 90. Diddy Kong, 40. Mario, 10. Blue Pinata, 60. Yellow Toad with 40. Paragoomba with 10. Goomba 
Hmm, fi fi finally got some high points from pitching. But Goomba with 75, and Toadette got some from running with 80. Alright, now for the Birdo Bird stats. Those are those stats right there. Their MVP has would have been Birdo. Mm, 30 from fielding. I don't really think Birdo deserves that as the way their fielding was missing some simple balls. But, um, yeah, so that is the first game of the Dini Monkey season. And they're looking really strong right now. So, let's go.